Hi, I'm Troy Parker, president of Innovative Labor and Cleaning. I want to thank you for taking the time and looking at these training videos. Now, my purpose for these training videos, as you all know, we're a second chance company. But I didn't want to just be a second chance company and just hire people and give them jobs and say, oh, what the hell with them. I noticed early on that a lot of people, like I did when I returned to the community, need help. And a lot of the help that people need is personal development. But in the personal development field, whether it be you know, Zig Ziglar, Tony Robbins, Bob Proctor, many of those courses cost anywhere from $8,000 or more to take. Now, do they work? Sure they do. But a lot of people, especially those that I was employing, could not afford to pay $7,000 or higher for personal development. So basically, I had studied a lot of this while I was incarcerated and plus since I've been out. So I wanted to make these videos to help individuals who want to change their life to have the tools they need. One of the first things that I want to share with you is the eight positive attitudes. I learned them while I was locked up in a drug treatment program while I was incarcerated. Now, the eight positive attitudes are the foundation or attributes that you'll use to build your foundation to a new attitude and a new self-image. Why is this important? If you have the same old attitude that you had last year, the year before, and you're not happy with your life right now, then if you try to make changes, the same self-image, the same attitude you're using to make the changes is the same one that wouldn't allow you to make the changes last year, the year before, and the year before that. For those of you who might think, well, I ain't nothing I want to change, that's fine. But someday you might want to change something, at least you'll have what it takes. For those of you who do want to make changes, you might be open-minded, which is one of the positive, eight positive attitudes, and look at maybe a new way of changing things from the inside out. Many times we sit and we'll meet a person or get in a situation and say, you know, that's got to change. I've heard you guys come back and say, man, I can't work for that dude. He need to change. But the only thing in life we can change is ourselves. We can't change the subcontractor. We can't change, you know, some other guy on the job, the superintendent, because they're outside of us. And as long as we keep looking for the change to happen outside of us, we're just going to keep looking because it's not going to happen. But we can change what's inside of us. And that's how we think and which is going to change how we act. The eight positive attitudes are caring, responsibility, open-mindedness, willingness, gratitude, objectivity, humility, and honesty. What I'll be doing in eight separate videos is giving you the definition of the positive attitude and I'll give examples of one, how people struggle with it using some of my own you know, struggles I've had and ways that you can show it in a positive way. Then what I would like you guys to do is more or less just study this video for a week. It's not going to be that long. So if you just keep playing it each week, what we want to do is turn these attributes into habits, much like when you get up in the morning, there are certain things you do every morning. You don't even think about you'll get up, you'll take a shower, brush your teeth, put your clothes on nine times out of 10. You don't even think about these things. You don't think, well, I got to pick up the toothpaste. I got to pick up the toothbrush. You just do it. Why? It's a habit. Now to prove that it's a habit and how turn it into a habit will help try tomorrow. And for the next week, try to do your morning routine the opposite way. So what I mean is if you're right handed starting tomorrow, start using your left hand to brush your teeth. All right. If you put your right leg in your pants first, Starting tomorrow, you just got to put your left and vice versa. What this is going to show you after probably two days, you're going to get frustrated. You'll see how, damn, now I got to physically think where before it just happened. Then you'll see my point of how turning something into a habit puts it on autopilot. You will automatically show these attributes. So if it's caring, you'll automatically show caring. If it's, you know, honesty, you'll automatically show it. There's behaviors right now and attitudes right now that you guys are showing that are habits. Many of you, if something happens on the job, you, you automatically will start cussing out, man, I'm sick of this crap. Oh, this, this. It's, it's all that, but it's a habit. You just automatically, if this happens, you act like this. My purpose here is to turn positive attributes into habits that will then change how you act 
and then help you to succeed in life. If there's something you want that's higher than where you're at now, you have to change how you are now to get on that frequency. If you're down here, you're not gonna be able to get up here if you don't make some changes. And those changes are gonna to have to come from within. And changing your attitude, which are the attributes and characteristics that you display, and changing your self-image, how you see yourself, is the only way to do that. So, thanks for watching this video and we'll get started with our next video. And always remember, it's up to you to make your life matter.